down the wicked, for they shall be ashes <laughs> under the soles of your feet in the day that I shall do this, saith the Lord of hosts. Lord of hosts. Something to meditate on. The you want to meditate? Uh, meditate on that. Yeah. Sorry. Uh, that's a good meditation. You ever have a dream of nuclear fire? No. The part of the Bhagavad Gita mentions. Where's Krishna talking? Just symbolic. Well, they say Krishna no. brought fire. He's, he's, he's predicting that the mammoth's going to split the atom and produce the nuclear bomb. Well, that's not what no. it says. That no, was no, an no, interpretation no. of it. Okay. Yeah. What I'm saying is, he said, death I have become. Here's the, the final words of Krishna in the Bhagavad Gita. This is nice to know. You could use it in preaching. Some crazy Hindus say, oh yeah, yeah. Well, anyone from India. Yeah, Cr Krishna derives from the, uh, the Greek word. Muslims that say that Hindus, they were in the Muslim country. Yeah. Okay. But the word Krishna derives from the Greek word Christ. There's no problem with it. I'm yeah. Okay. Krishna says, give up all the varieties of religion and surrender unto me. Imagine if Jesus said something like that. Well, he did. He said to help this world. Well, Krishna is a bootlegged Jesus. Okay. He's, a ba he, he's a bastardized Jesus, but it's not the truth. You got to get your mind out to Bhagavad Gita and the Hindu. Well, regardless, this is, this is the uh, help right here. The Lord said, uh, uh, my, he said, give me your yoke. He said, oh, I'm going to get a real quick. Just roll. What was that? The hell with Christians. The hell with the Hindu. Oh, get this hey, Caitlin, hey, Caitlyn Jenner. You know about Caitlyn Jenner? They got, got trouble. He might be facing murder charges. Hey, that's, that's the spirit of the Lord. That's the spirit of the Lord. That's the spirit of the Lord. Yep. Check this out. That'll be beautiful too, man. That's what the Lord. Listen, right, Matthew, right, right. He can eleven and like twenty-eight. Three years, three, five years. Actually, let me start at 20. He got money to pay that too. Let me start at 27. All things, Matthew 11, 27. All things are delivered unto me of my Father, and no man knoweth the Son but the Father. Neither knoweth any man the Father save the Son, and he to whomsoever the Son will reveal him. So the, the Yahweh Shai got to reveal the truth to you. But listen, come unto me, all ye that labor and are head heavy laden, and I will give you rest. For those, he's saying those of you that are stressed out yeah. and oppressed. Yep. Check this out. Take my yoke upon you and learn of me. For I am meek and lowly in heart. And you shall find rest unto your soul. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Seriously. Now meditate on that. Oh, yeah, I've, I've done yeah. that before. Back when I was... Perfect More size. like I didn't have a neighbor and I had time to receive. Hey, what you What's your next like, weekend? Uh, we here. Here. What do you want to to the Lord today? Or fucking freshmen coming in. Preceded him that were known what's going on, right? But well, you can't even read it unless the, the Lord put the Spirit on it. Yeah. Because well, a lot of people will start reading this, yeah. and the Spirit of sleep will come upon. They'll fall asleep. Fall asleep. Yeah. yeah. Wow. <laughs> literally, literally fall asleep. I hear, I hear numerous people yeah. tell me that. I try to read the Bible, I fall asleep. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. I, I mean, that. actually, I was reading scriptures and breaking it down to people, women, yeah. and they actually fell asleep while I'm reading. <laughs> I'm reading I mean, to them, and so, they fell asleep. Uh, they were so. They want to. They want to. So they want to screw. They want to do some. They want to do. The, they want to do the nasty. What That's all. They ain't mine. Right. You know, they ain't thinking about no. This will put any of these oh, people. Asleep. Yeah, right, they already right. asleep. Hey, that's a drink date rate drug. Wow. Date rate drug. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Don't let Bill Cosby get it. <laughs> I usually meditate before five right. in the morning. Great noise, <laughs> yeah. my neighbor. So, what I learned that when you get up in the morning and meditate, the rest of the day it doesn't matter. You get in touch with the spirit. Everybody, you know. People out here, the majority of them are not. Of course, be they don't matter. They're insignificant. So, well, how, how many people pay attention to you? <laughs> not many. You have to have a license. A very few. Not many. Yeah. No. The, the, nope. the Lord said many are. Have have if we had a mic out here on a mic, we would have to have a, uh, uh, like a vendor's license yeah. or something like that. But the Lord said, for many are called, but few are chosen. Wow. I mean, it's obvious that very few people are spiritual. Very uh, well. Very few. This, this is a carnal world. We, this is Satan's kingdom we live in. You really believe that? Oh, well, that's true. I, oh, 
It's obvious. The Church well, of Satan. Was it's found, obvious. The Church of Satan was founded in San Francisco legally <laughs> under a 501c3 tax exempt status. Can be proven. Is that why it's the most expensive and most overcrowded city? For, you get a house in the United States. I've been there. I know. But that's You're not the home of Satan. Find a place to live there. Unless you want to be a homosexual and bow down to that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then you have a place to live, you won't have any well, In America, Muslims can walk around freely. Yeah. Devil, you can walk down the street with 666 tattooed on your head with artificial horns coming at your head. Hell, that new Satan statue is on tour right now to you of the United States. Yeah, gay marriage was legalized. Yeah. yeah. Homosexual. Sodomites. Sodomite. I mean, Sodomites. Sodom of the Lord. Well, shit, this look. is worse than Sodom. Mm -hmm. and look at that. Every single woman I mean, dressing America like a whore. America is Sodom. Yeah. America yeah, is Rome, yeah. America is Egypt, it is Babylon. So, oh, here's the way I look symbolically. Remember the Roman Empire? This is America. America. Remember the British Empire? Yeah. yeah. No, this is American. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's the, it, it's the reincarnation of Rome. They even used the eagle. Did the Romans yeah. use mm -hmm. Zeus's eagle? The eagle has landed. They even used Latin writing on the dollar bills. The language uh, of the Romans. He pulled this Ulum. Yeah, the, the, the Marines' motto is Semper Fidelis. That's Latin. Yeah. With an eagle globe and anchor. That's why when I mentioned Sanskrit, I've had a lot of people trying to get me into a church that was based on what did you Latin. Say? The Latin yeah. Catholic Church. Yeah. Yeah, they use Latin. Well, the Bible is written in Hebrew, and they use Latin. Okay. <laughs> I, that's what I told my landlord. He's trying to get me. He goes, "Oh, so you're a uh, Messianic Jew? Messianic Jew? Yeah, I said you can't discriminate." I've had black people come in here and call me a duck. Oh, get into the races. It's not that dumb. I've lived care, in New York City. And then this white trash guy comes in and he says, oh, I'm an artist. I go, what? He goes, remember when I told you to suck my dick? He goes, oh, you're a drunk, right? Goes, but I've put pigs out in prison and I don't like you. And I go, I don't like you either, but I'm a Christian. Aren't you a Christian? <laughs> What are you so angry about? The landlord could kick you out. He can't kick you out. He's like a lawyer named Abraham. You see what I'm saying? He said he's not got a lawyer named Abraham. No, it's true. Right, right, I right. used to work for a man called William J. Abraham. He's from Lebanon. What? He ain't by, oh, he's a, okay. Well, legally. All right, brother, that's your bus. Yeah, thank you for sharing. Okay, we'll see man. you again. Yep. Maybe we yep. Let's wrap it up. All right, one yeah. more word for the camera. That's all I got to say. Ooh. Yeah, Go ahead and shut that down.